In Super Bowl 32, Terrell Davis scored three touchdowns and earned MVP honors. Elway handoff, Davis into the end zone, touchdown! The Broncos pulled off one of the most stunning upsets in Super Bowl history. Now, a greater challenge faced them. Anytime you have success, it's always easy to get a little bit complacent in the offseason. Uh, you feel good about what you accomplished from the year before, so you lose a little bit of that edge, that desire, that drive. In the offseason, Davis added 13 pounds of muscle while reducing his body fat to 6%. He came to Denver as a sixth round pick, hoping to make the team. A superstar four years later, his goals remained team oriented. I worked out all off season to try to come to make sure that at this point in time that I'm doing everything I can, I can do for the team and you know hopefully I have a good year this year. Davis's work habits, among the most diligent in the NFL, helped raise the level of play of everyone around him. Woo! Smoke. PD! PD! Go man, that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Two years ago, you go to training camp and the coach says something about winning a championship. Now, how many players on the team believe that? Not many. Uh, but this year, when he says, let's go win a championship, he says it with conviction, and, and all the players believe that. Man, the one thing we're going to have to do as a team is learn how to finish plays. But doing what we did today, man, was a farce. That's not the way we operate around here. You guys want to be 500 football team? That's the way we're going right now. You guys got to pick it up. Man, we're going to have some adversity once we go through the year on both phases of the ball. And what you do is you don't worry about somebody else. You do your job, and you do it as good as you possibly can do it, and then some. Let's do it the way we're supposed to do it. The most difficult task in sports is to duplicate a championship season. Each week, the Broncos knocked away all who tried to take their crown. Ball! Ball! When the Broncos had the ball, they knew who to give it to. 17 fullback counter. I want it. I see one coming. Seven. Elway with Davis behind him. Hand off. Davis cuts back. Davis bounces left side. Here we go. 40. Midfield. It's a foot race. 40. 35. 30. 25. 20. 15. 10. 5. Touchdown. In Denver's impressively graceful and efficient running game, Davis ran north and south or downhill, relying on keen vision and quick feet. TD would wait patiently for his blocks to form and to accent his decisive cuts with instant acceleration. Hand off, Davis running right side, bounces outside, he's got a hole, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! This is Davis, left side, nice block by Tony Jones, Davis, big hole, Davis, 30, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, Terrell Davis! In 1998, Davis became the fourth fastest running back to gain 6,000 career yards, and in his seventh game, reached another milestone. Third guy in the history of the game to get over a thousand yards in the seventh game in the history of the game, TD. In Denver, he loomed larger than life. He became just the fourth back in league history to rush for more than 2,000 yards in a season and has gone places few NFL players have been before. A lot of people are asked to go on the Leno Show, the Letterman Show, and shows like that, but how many players are actually asked to go on the Sesame Street show? Not many. Ah, uh, thanks, Terrell. You the man, Elmo. No, you the man. No, you the man. You the man. You the man. No, you the you man. man. No, I can't no, I'm the football. <laughs> <laughs> man, it's wide open. It's wide open, fellas. They're giving it to us. To stop the Broncos' featured weapon, defenses attack with multiple pursuit angles. You know every time we run a Fox 2, H2, fake, whatever, they bring in a house. Like a wave rushing to one side, defenders gang tackle Davis. Man, I miss, I miss the... Boy, I got freaks. Woo, there's the freaks, man. There's going to be some games where they're going to take away your passing game. Some days they're going to take away your running game. But the main ingredient is a final way to win as a football team, and that's what I think we have. A lot of guys that are unselfish. With a team before me attitude, Denver ripped off 13 straight wins and became only the third Super Bowl team to have a better regular season record following a championship year. The Broncos won convincingly and decisively. And soon the question was not if they would repeat, but could Denver go undefeated?
Make sure you guys stick together, you keep on working hard, we can accomplish anything. In week 15, the Broncos trailed in the fourth quarter for only the second time all season. Still, they knew how to get themselves out of the hole. Nice hole, Terrell, 25, Terrell breaks the tackle, 10, 5, touchdown Denver! With all the determination you'd expect from a champion, Denver regained the lead. But in the game's final minute, the Broncos' dreams for an undefeated season slipped away. There's always kind of a time of realization once you do lose a football game and everybody goes back and they look at themselves and they say, hey, why did we lose that football game? So if there is any positive with losing, it's uh, going back and making sure you do the little things and do them right so it doesn't happen again. Losses in two of their final three games helped the Broncos regain their focus. Our whole goal was to come in here and to get home field advantage and to, to hopefully put ourselves in another position to uh, get another championship. It was never to be undefeated, but I think we're still on course and we still have our goals in, in sight. And so, uh, you know, that it happened. It's gone. Let's just move on. Now, Count, I need you to tell me or count down to how many games we have to the Super Bowl. Oh, yes. Here we go. One game. No, make that two games to the two Super Bowl. No, three games to the Jesus. Super Bowl. Our goal is to be Super Bowl champs. And, you know, it's a long haul. and We've had a good one so far, and hopefully we can play our best football once we get to the playoffs.